up stew. Then dog. Today we're here to do an awesome sauce. Fire Dragon Chilies New Zealand Chili Eating Champ Sauce 2016. I'll give it to Dennis and he can have a bit of a read. I, I think in celebration we might do a teaspoon of the sauce. Teaspoon? Teaspoon? What do you oh. suggest? Huh? Well, um, if these guys are having this one in a chili competition, I think we could do a bit better than a teaspoon, wouldn't we? Maybe a shot glass is in order there. Shot glass, yeah, alright, bring it on. Strangely enough, we had prepared some earlier. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> Okay, we'll, we'll read the blurb as soon as we have the sauce. Okay. If we can. If we can. <laughs> um, a warning with this is it's probably not for everyone doing a shot glass full. Um, it's not what the company would recommend, so we're, we're doing it with our own free The hottest sauce currently made in New Zealand is not for the faint hearted, it is made out of serious so, uh, chili. Please but be cautious. In respect to all the people that enter the chili eating comps, chili heads out there, we salute you. There's a lot in those glasses. Mm. Ooh. Okay, you want to do the bar? Can you just give me a minute for us? <clears throat> it's not a bad flavour initially. It's um very savoury. Immediate heat on the throat. Instant heat. Uh, instant. Instant heat. I have a bit of difficulty reading this. The reason why it's up to slide. This year we have taken out the chili extract and smashed in as many chilies as possible. Top row. It is packed with Carolina Reapers, um, Marugas, Brainstone, Butlers, Dougalers, Chocolate Butts. Yellow seven pots and marugas. You can definitely taste the hell on red. It's the world's hottest chili. It's all right here in the one sauce. All New Zealand grown in the far north. There's only a hundred of these bottles produced. I'll see why. I can uh, feel the sauce moving down my stomach. Ooh, it's certainly burning the throat. I've got the throat burn. How are you finding? Yeah, a lot of saliva, my eyes are watering, a lot of heat. It is, and that's top. Building, especially the Carolina Reaper. Nasty Still building. Chili. Still building. It's a lot of heat. While we're here, we should do a shout out to somewhere we're going in the near future, the Hot Sauce Festival. <sighs> you can talk from it. <laughs> Up in Auckland in the Sweet Shop Brewery um, on the 25th of June 2016. We're heading up to Auckland to have a look at all the fantastic sauce makers that we've been reviewing and doing work for over the last six months. So we're excited about that and it's also the final of the Chili Eating Champ, so we'll be there to cheer you on. Yeah, yeah. Dog. It's actually, we're looking forward to this Chili Sauce Fest. We're coming up to represent the South. At the day they have um, the National Chili Eating Champs, the finals. They also have a homemade hot sauce competition. They have switch shot and produced a chili beer for the occasion. Especially fiery cocktails and spicy menus. So it's going to be a really great day. I recommend everyone coming out for a chili here, go and check it out. Come and support it. It's a great Come festival. and visit us. We'll be there. So yeah, 25th of June. Thank you a lot. Be great. Awesome. So what sort of taste are you getting now from the sauce? Well, little chilies that are in there. Peak sort of, I wouldn't say it's peak, but no, it is peak, it's not climbing that long, but it's true, sort of feel it coming down my throat. You can definitely taste whatever chilli you've got in there, you can definitely tell that these are super hot chilli. Out of 10, what would you give for heat? Apparently right now, I would say, the fact that this is a uh, natural chilli sauce and has not any extract at all, I would probably rate that about a 9, 9.5 even. I'd go possibly 10. Yeah, it is to be a hot sauce. <coughs> to be one of the hottest natural made chilli sauces I've ever tasted. And, and flavour is good too. Even with the heat, it still contains a nice flavour. 
Yeah, it does. You can yep. use it in cooking, but to me, this sauce is buy a bottle and get a few friends around that are keen on the hot stuff and just test yourself. See, you've got handy with jingle. What do you think? Yeah, that's why I do it stuff now. Um, something I might say about hot sauces too while I'm sitting here burning is the hot of the chili, the thicker the milk. Like if you're having an average sauce to cool it down, a good milk's okay. Maybe a yogurt or something with a super hot sauce. It really helps calm things down with the stomach and the throat. So, so what I'm starting to feel now is a really good chili pie coming on. Oh, definitely. My the dolphins are really cranking. Just looking around the room, you know, wahoo, you know. Yeah, this is definitely something not to be messed with. But great fun. Great sauce. It is a great sauce. I would definitely rate that nine and a half out of ten. Flavour, I'd say definitely uh, probably eight or nine. Definitely fl very flavoursome and definitely made out of straight chilli. You couldn't get much better. It's got onions and garlic and lime juice in it and sea salt. A lot of good stuff in there too. I've got a very mouth pain that's still building. Yeah, yeah. I feel like sort of, I think the chilli sauce has gotten down to the chest now. Feel it going down, but um, I'll tell you, absolutely top work. Top marks, Yep, well done. We will see you on the 25th of June. Very good. Thank you for watching. All right.